Welcome back, everybody, to the next internet sensational. I don't know what I'm saying right now. We're gonna, we're gonna, now we're good. It's fine. We're gonna let it ride. We're gonna let it ride. As initial cast to cost this, that's not how words work. Sack a dude. You draw cards equal to the power, and then you gain life equal to the toughness. Luminous wake. Pathraiser of Uli can't be blocked except by three or more bros. That guy's just gonna kill you. Can we get to eleven mana? Is that a reasonable thing to do? Path Razor of Ulamog. Ramp. Ramo Ramp Cringe Face. <laughs> okay, we're doing good. We'll do it live. All right, take the... I think it is this guy. Like, this guy seems good, right? Get that path racer. I want a card that says target player gets an egg one, neg one. Spaghetti bro. Oh, Fiend Slayer Paladin. This is actually my M14 preview card. That's kind of funny. Mm. Actually, it was either this or Witch Stalker. No, it was originally Fiend Slayer Paladin, I think. And then they accidentally spoiled Fiend Slayer Paladin, so they had to give us Witch Stalker instead. That's kind of funny. Hmm. It's not Root Walla, it's not... It might just be Fiend Slayer Paladin. What was Witch Stalker, that stupid looking dog? Yeah, man. That was the dog... Dog bro. First Strike and Lifelink, it can't be targeted Black or Red spells. That's pretty good. Alright, I'll take this guy. Oh, Transcendence, what do you do? You don't lose the game for having zero or less life. That sounds great. When you have 20 or more life, you lose the game. Whenever you lose life, you gain two life for each one life you lost. What the shit? What are you transcending? <laughs> like nothing? What a bunch of hot garbage. Choose a color and then you can sack it to give a different creature pro. Frontal damage, a source of... Okay, that's hot trash. This is a 3 3 for 5. Whenever it deals combat damage, destroy a creature. It can't be regenerated. It gains flying and protection from green and what? Remember, it deals combat damage to a. Oh, that's, that's to a creature. Alright, whatever. Yeah, you're definitely. I don't actually know what to take here. Protection from black. You know what? I'm just going to take this guy. I really have no idea. It's going too fast for me. It was too quick. I couldn't do it. I couldn't handle it. <laughs> Did you like that face? That was good. All right, it's either Simic Signet or Boros Signet. We have a white card already, so I like Boros Signet, but here's the here's the catch, guys. If we take the green Signet, we could be green. Discard a card, it gains flying and pro green and pro white till end of turn. That's actually not bad. I don't feel terrible about that guy. If we take this, we can actually put this guy in the sideboard and be uh, uh, Sultai. You guys know Sultai? Gonna leave my whole life behind. Oh, look who it is. Got a Mike B joining. A wild Mike B. I don't know what to take here. I'm gonna take this Simic Signet, I guess. I have no friggin' idea. This has not been the clearest so far. Oh god, he just dropped a whole thing on the ground. Oh, he messed up real bad. I did not. He totally did. He literally broke everything I own. Oh, that? Yeah. Everything in the background is broken. I also fed the cat, so he should not be as loud this time. 
Could they hear that? <laughs> yeah, everyone can hear that. Could you hear that? Oh, the hat? Yeah. I think you just said, oh, the Hayat? Yeah. Oh, yeah, the Hayat. All right. Pack is pretty bad. Do we just want 2 2 Fear Boy? Yeah, probably 2 2 Fear Boy is pretty good. Oh, we can combo. With? Any, with Sahili that we're going to open, duh. Yeah, just That'd stupid, be pretty amazing. Stupid dummy. Return a creature from your graveyard to your hand. If you control an artifact, draw a card. We're not going to be controlling an artifact, I imagine. Destroy permanent, only seven mana. The bargain price. But you can do it over and over. Oh, wait, no, you have to sacrifice it. Never mind. Oh, that would be sick. Oh, I would 100% take that. I'm going to take this guy because it could be good with lots of things. Ooh, this fancy pack. Border post is good. What about this? Look at this. Look at this guy. He's having a good time. He's all armored up. Oh. I love Glass Dust Hulk, but I don't think this is a deck for it. I don't think so either. Wait, is my pig a different color now? Yeah, it's a little brighter. It's a little rosier in the cheeks. I was thinking of actually changing the subscriber uh, badge. Eh, I think it's just this. Whatever. We're white. We're green. We're all the things. I don't think we're green yet. We are totally green, you stupid son of a Mitch. I ain't no goddamn son of a Mitch. No, I am. Oh, destroy an enchantment. That's a good dude. I'm going to take it. And we can blink it. Hey, man, you know what likes lemonade better? Tell me. When it sparkles. What did you put it? You got, wait, what do you got? Sparkling lemonade zero. It's delicious. Is that what it's called? Sparkling lemonade zero? Well, it's ice zero or whatever it's called. Oh, those ices are real good. Five for five. Mike, now that you're sober, what can you say about Log of Woolen? Uh, I think it's pretty good. It is a bit smoky, but that was as advertised. You know who else is smoky? The bear. Yeah, I guess so. Say, look, now we're green. What problem is? <laughs> is Bramble Crush even good? I don't know. Any non-creature permanent. Like, it's Artifact, it's Enchantment, it's Planeswalker. It ain't terrible. I guess it does also take out a land if you wanted to. If you're that guy. That limited guy where you're like, I'm playing all the four mana land destruction. Three through for six, trample, discard card, regenerate. You gain life field under the creature card. Oh, Christ. I guess we're just taking this. Six mana for a three three? Nah, man, that ain't making it. It's got trample, though, man. Uh-huh. What does that zombie do? This grotesque hybrid? Mm -hmm. Oh, we got the Avacyn's Pilgrim back. That's pretty gas. I want this ground assault, but... I assume you read this. You good? Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna take the Pilgrim. See, now we're definitely green. Now we're now we're Abzan. Obzan, if you will. Bramble Crush mean green, basically. Yeah, it's basically green Vindicate. How did I get East Mountain Down stuck in your head? You don't want to take that thing that dealt damage equal to their creatures? For four mana. <laughs> what if they have 20 creatures? What if they have none and we have two? Hmm. Cut black. Why don't you shut up? Do you ever think about that? Got him. Look, now we got this and we have border post and signet to trigger it. So we draw a card. Come on. Come on, buddy. Yeah, this is our first pick. Come on, buddy. That was your first pick? Yeah, man. Wow. It does annihilate. Wow. How much does that thing cost? 11. Oof. <laughs> Oof. You don't think that's reasonable? You don't think that's a reasonable casting cost? Oh, look at that. Fixing. Got him. Verdant Haven's good. It's basically like a worse gift of paradise, right? It gains you two instead of three. So they're like, let's give him one more life. I'm actually tempted to take this. Heat Ray is good. Siege Worm's good. Verdant Haven's good if you want to be rampant. You know what Convoke does? Yeah. Yeah? You've seen that ability? I've seen it. Yeah. A couple times. I bet this comes back. I think it actually is Verdant Haven. We want the Ramo still. Yeah, I got you. Always be Ramoing. 
Siege Worm looks like a Wang, though. It's true. It does. So does Ardent Worm. So Ad- most worms. Ard- is uh, Armada Worm. That's what it is. Not Ardent Worm. I don't know what Ardent Worm is. I think I just made that up. Dude, if that cat starts crying again, I'm just going to rage. Oh, I like I like Final Sting Fairy. Destroy a creature that was self-damaged this turn. He's going to get you. Get you. Get you. Let me hit you again. What is that? What are you doing there? Oh, that's just me. I'm just going to hit you again. Uh, at the beginning of your upkeep, you may reveal the top card. If it's an elf or a warrior, it gets a counter on it. That's good, but I don't think we're going to have that happen. Enchanted creature can attack. Ooh. Oh, yeah, that's pretty good. Weight of conscience is nice. I'm going to take that. Get that spray bottle for for Mike. Siege Rum's got a little hat. <laughs> I like that you said that. You're like, hey, I need I need Frank to know that Siege Rum has a little hat on it. Hold on, let me tell him. When Groff Skirther, that's that's German for sure. Uh, return a card named Bl- Groff Skirther from your graveyard to your hand. If you have multiple of these, it's pretty good. You can just keep cycling through your. Your other three mana six sixes. Apparently, three six mana three threes were uh, that was the bargain rate back in the day. Boogeyman, what's going on? Greetings from Argentina. Thank you so much. Really appreciate it. I was hoping this was a I got a tap for mana, but it wasn't. We can give give our dudes flight. Easy tree. How is it? In, I think I'd rather just have predator strike plus three plus three and trample is op. Yeah, it seems alright. Oh, we can get a little kiss. Kiss from a rose on the grave? Kiss from the Amisha on the grave. Bruh. Nah. I think it's either Stuart or actually Kiss and we can splash it off this Simic Signet. Or we can splash it off this Verdant Haven. We, can, we could give this dude flight. So now you can't Jeez. be blocked by more than... Th- except three or more creatures and a fly, and they have to fly, so... That's pretty good. Also, our opponent killed us with this last round. So that was cool. I think it's either one of these two. Thunder. 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 But this guy adds mana. And that seems important. But this is a very strong card. I'm going to take this. Just draw two cards and gain seven. That's nuts, man. It's not bad. And by not bad, you mean just fantastic. Those are one and the same thing. How dare you talk to me like that? Go live on the street. On the streets? Got him. I like Elder. When Tilling Tree Folk enters the battlefield, you may return up to two land cards from your graveyard to your hand. Hmm. Uh, when this enters battlefield, return a creature card from your graveyard with the greatest power. If two or more are tied, you choose. I like that. That seems good. That's literally just a Plus grave. It's a hag. Yeah. <laughs> Who doesn't want to play a hag? This is a merfolk wizard. Hag. Yes, a merfolk wizard hag. My mis- my mistake. You're cutting the bramble crush, man. Yeah. You're hyping it up so much, though. Was I really? I thought I was just explaining what it did. Destroy each target enchantment each other enchantment that shows a color with it. This guy's a fine two too. Oh, Flight of Fancy seems great actually. Put it on our path razor. I told you we're going Simic. Or Sultai. White Sultai. White Sultai. Merfolk Hag Wizard Hag is my favorite tribe. I was just watching the stream where the, that, that mic is more ice than the water that was first coined. Wow, that's an old one, isn't it? He's more ice now than water. Cold and solid. I want to take out this Severed Legion. I don't think that double black guy is getting cast here. I like how you keep that six mana 3 3 in. He's got trample, though. Uh huh. <laughs> Look, man. This is a chaos draft. A lot of the power levels are pretty low, right? Not in your opponent's decks. Maybe that's true. More like damp Amzan. Hmm. Amzan? Is that your insurance company? Yeah. Amzan.com. Your insurance company's a website? Uh-huh. Huh. Amzan. Well, it's not a website. It has a website. 
you know, like most modern companies. Yeah, Come but the, yeah, but you, it sounded like you were replacing the name that I said with Ab, Amzam.com, which was the name of the, you know what? No, no drunk stream tonight. Echoing truth? Adding one man of any color could be relevant, but I really don't want to play this one one for one. I think it's just echoing truth. What is he complaining about now? Dude, I don't know. He's been real. He's been a real... He even got to get out of the house? He's What? He got out of the house? Yeah, he was sitting by the door when I opened it, and he just jumped out. I, there was a snake on the back porch today. Ooh. I, I, when I well, As soon as I went out there, it it's skittered out the door. But it went under the door, like the back door, the back the, the door that leads to the yard. Right. And I was like, oh, I don't have to open that for you to get in. That's fascinating. Yeah, this pack's pretty bad. Just a danger noodle, man. No biggie. You know what kind of snake it was? No, I actually don't mind snakes. I'm less scared of snakes than other things. And then a bug came skittering in, and I was like, ah! And then I killed that, unfortunately. Oh, the siege worm came back. That's pretty cool. All right. It's a much better trample creature. Trampley doodle. Mike, did you get did you get a bad hangover after that nice scotch you were drinking? Nah. Bugs are alien. I might have had a slight hangover, but it wasn't that wasn't a big deal. Was it? Off. Did it remind you of that movie, The Hangover? No. Hmm. I didn't. Uh, didn't meet Mike Tyson or uh, have a tiger in my room, so not really. Yet. Shine wind and just battlefield to counter on it. Remove a counter on it. Destroy an enchantment. Ugh. I'll just take this guy. Whatever. Elf warrior. I don't think I have any elf warriors yet. So it's probably just going to be a 3-2 forever. Human knight. Aura. Yep. Literally no elves or warriors in this deck. Uh, no, because those are anthropomorphic fun bugs, and I don't mind those guys. I really don't mind bugs. I think I just don't like roaches, and... I'm not a fan of scorpions. That's because they're scary. Yeah, I, I think it's just roaches. Scorps in this town. I ain't seen a scorp in a minute. What about two minutes? Still no. Hmm. Look at this weird ass. <laughs> Look at this card. His hands are skulls. Whatever, this guy's fine. Target creature gets plus one plus O oh for each artifact. Jesus Christ. These so narrow, dude. Nantugo Monastery seems okay. Maybe. Riftstone Portal, if we can get that into the graveyard, is really good. Pulse Mage Advocate. Return three target cards from an opponent's graveyard to their hand. Return target creature card from your graveyard to the battlefield. So, we give them three cards to return a guy from the graveyard to the battlefield. Wow. I mean, I get, that it, I get that it turns off Threshold, but... Good lord, man. At what cost? Put the cards from your grid on the bottom of your library. Battlefield gets plus three, plus three until end of turn. Activate this only once each turn if you have... Okay, so it's three, three for five. And if you have threshold, you can get rid of your own threshold to give it plus three, plus three. And not even trample. That's sad. Return a creature card from your grid to your hand. Return a creature from the, to the battlefield instead. All right, not terrible. If we can get this guy in the graveyard, we can actually stitch together. That's actually Mike's Wicked Mullet. That's not a... That's not actually a... But when I sit forward, my mullet goes away. Oh, cool. We just took the Pulse Mage because the, our time ran out. That's cool. I literally had no idea what to pick in that pack, so we took a card we can't play. Or won't play, rather, because it's not very good. Put an artifact creature enchantment on top of its owner's library for five mana? Crying out loud. Three or four trample for four? Eh. I kind of like Geyser who returns to an all land permanents to their owner's hand. Double bounce them. Yeah, that's pretty good. Or sack a dude to draw three. 
the Mike Hypothesis. Thank you so much for the sub. Really appreciate it. Welcome, welcome. I want to take the, the bouncer now. Oh, remember this guy? I do. That card is pretty good. There's also Rancor in this pack. That's true. Rancor ain't no joke. Is it Urza's Blueprints or Rancor? What do you guys think? Oh my god, I can't get over this. I'm just like, really? Three cards? Is there a catch? Blueprint, sack I gotta draw three as a sorcery. Always always Rancor, Blueprints, Rancor, Rancor, Rancor. Really? You guys like Rancor over the Blueprints? I do. I think the format is kind of slow. Like, drawing two cards a turn is pretty ridiculous. Everyone says Rancor. Aura Flux? I don't even know what that is. Where is that? Uh, the sign in this pack. All right, I'm taking this. Man, you crazy? I don't think you can look at it that way, where you have to draw like five cards for it to be worth it. Like, I don't think that's the way. Like. I don't think in limited it works that way. Like, if you draw three cards off of this, you're still way ahead. And, like, in the later turns, like, you, there's so many times where you're not even going to be using that mana anyway. <sighs> Cloud Shift? It's good with this. We need more creatures. We have ten. Mm -hmm. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. Oh, I like being able to blink Flight of Fancy. All right, let's take a... Ugh, crying out loud. There's no good creatures even in this pack. It's a pretty poor excuse, whatever. It's a pretty poor excuse for a... a what is that, Masters a 25th Anniversary pack? Yeah, this pack's not great either. This pack is actually pretty bad. There's like no creatures in it, basically. I'll just take Purge, because it's a great sideboard card, but... God lord. Terrible Aura. Terrible Sorcery. Terrible Instant. Terrible creature, terrible creature for, for limited. Not great. Not great. Like, this pack is pretty mediocre. It is not good. Uh, I'd rather take the Celestial Purge because I don't want to be too heavy blue. Like, we have three blue cards and I think that's fine. Ooh, Revelation again. I think it's Arbor Elf. So it's seven mana to get two cards. For what? Oh, yeah. It's tutor to tutor twice. Actually, maybe it's Sentinel Spider Man. Vigil Originals are each just pretty good. We took it. We did it, boys. <laughs> Who's he talking to? I'm gonna take this Winter Patrol out. Cutting creature. I like it. A bold strategy. Why don't you shut up? Whenever you cast a Tree Folk, you may give plus three, negative three. This card is great, but I don't think we have any Tree Folk. Which is pretty sad. What about Changeling? No. You don't want that little cutie? Oh, you're asking? It's blue, though. Mm-hmm. Oh, this guy. This guy, though. No, that guy's fine. This guy's not great. This guy's not great. This guy's not great. Target force comes X, X, where X is the number of elves you control. Probably going to be zero. Whatever. This is not great, but it's probably, like, the best we got. I got the Luminous Wake, I guess. This is 23. The blue guy is green and the green guy is blue. What are you saying right now? Case, I think you're drunk, buddy. Thunder. Da -da Thunder. Our deck looks cool. Poorly at best? Wow, I was actually liking this a lot. We have like card advantage, really good top end here. Card advantage, card advantage, card advantage, uh, really good trick. Destroy an enchantment, draw two. And flight. Ramp, ramp. I think this deck is cool so far. I like this guy. Just the 4 7 idiot and then Cyclone if it's not great. Remember this guy? This guy wrecked us. Oh, he did. Yeah, I'll just take Big Idiot. Riftstone Portal. Toxic Stench and Stitch Together came back. These are the only cards I was actually looking for in this pack. That's kind of funny. Destroy a dude with this. 
Hmm. Sixteen seconds. This I don't see any way, way to get this in the graveyard, unfortunately. No. So I don't think it's that. I don't think it's double black stitched together. I'm pretty sure it's just toxic stench. I like this for the sideboard. Destroy a floater. I would walk 100 miles. Plus one, plus one, and reach until end of turn. Cool. Sacrifice this to deal two damage. Start attacking your blocking creature. That's actually not bad. Flash Pro Red is actually pretty good too. <gasps> it's one of these two. What do you think? I like the Pro Red guy for the board. Yeah, same. I would walk 100 miles. Oh, look, 4-3. Want to play that guy? All right, we need two cuts. Oh, wow, that came back? Jeez. <coughs> Maybe a resourceful return? Yeah, we actually probably don't need resourceful for the return, especially because we have the Desecrator Hag. And our creature count is fairly low. You're fairly low. Creatures get low, low, low. Got him. Did you? I got him. This could be the deck in Wildfire Border Post. Wildfield Border Post just acts as a land. Sure. Yeah, that seems fine, actually. So, two black. Probably going to three here and cut down to six here. Double white seems rough. Three here and four here. Six. Yeah, I think this seems good. Ten time to sleep, bid. Zaxor, have a good night, buddy. Three black is all we need, because this isn't actually a black card. Our only black cards are, like, Grotesque and Toxic Stench. So that's fine. Uh, white, we have double white, and we have a bunch of white stuff. Blue, we have three blue cards, and we also have a, a Signet. Yeah, let's do that. All right. I'm in. Really? This art? Interesting. Looks like he's making a dude. Making a dude? Mm-hmm. Who's making a dude? That guy walking up the steps. He's making a dude? Mm-hmm. Oh, like this? Mm hmm Oh, I see what you're saying. I got you. I play Kiss of the Emission, one of my very first decks. It's a good card. Hey, man, go, go, go to the doctor and get your stir const fixed. It's out of date. It always is. Oh, it's your boy. Wow. Amazing. We'll keep this hand. Why should you that border post? I don't know. I forgot how it worked for a second. Also, we could probably just play it on turn three-ish and just ramp into it. Yeah, there's no reason to play it now. We can actually just use it as a ramp. We really don't need the mana, so... Front the next one damage that'll be able to each creature and each player this turn. That's interesting. Well, that dude doesn't do anything. Alright, so we're going to play you. One, two, three. Burden Haven on you. And a lot of green. And play this guy. A lot of things just happen. One, two, three, four, five, six. We also have seven mana next turn. One, three. All right. Sack it. It deals three damage to target attacker or blocker. You got it. 
All right. We have a lot of lands. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So our mana is pretty, pretty on point here. Well, that destroys an enchantment. Unfortunately, they have an artifact, so... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We almost have, we literally almost have uh, Pathraiser of Ulamog mana, which is pretty cool. Uh, no attacks to be done here, unfortunately. Man, this is a really interesting game. This is, uh, this is intense. The intensity is real. Yep, yep. All right, we're doing good. We're doing good. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We've drawn nine of our 17 lands, and we've drawn... This and this are like we mix this. We have like nineteen lands, I guess. All right, they didn't. All right, this is intense. <laughs> it's basically a land. How how is it real? That's the question we're asking ourselves, ladies and gentlemen. I'm just gonna hold this planes in hand. Boy, we have Pathraiser mana. Oh, you wanted a creature, you say? Hmm. Didn't specify. I guess I should have been more clear, Magic the Gathering. Uh oh, things are things are happening here. Look how look how amazing this art is. Oh, what up, hag? That's a cool mouth. What if your mouth looked like that? I don't know what you're doing right now. Right. <laughs> oh, he's being the hag that he wants to see in the world. That's nice. That's a little, that's a little Gandhi there. You know Gandhi? Who that? Okay. Good talk. See that old guy who ate a lot of hot dogs? Yes, he was the old hot dog guy. Everybody knows that. Uh, deals three damage, sure. And it gets exiled. Mike, do you have a collection of paper tokens? How do you store them? Do you keep them in the deck box or whatever deck they go to? Do you have a token Biden? No, I just keep them in the deck box. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Where's the friggin'. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen mana. Thirteen mana. They have eight cards in hand. Caleb has eight cards. I don't know what they could be. Oh boy, if only this absolver throw killed artifacts instead. Wouldn't that be something? Wouldn't that be uh wouldn't that be just the best? Oh, why aren't you an artifact? Why are you an enchantment killer? Mike Bar Boo, that's good. I like it. Well, definitely blocking here. No double block? The five five? Oh, I thought it was a three three. Oh, that would be nice. Well, I guess we're double blocking, and then they're killing our abs. Nope, that doesn't even make sense. Yeah, I'm just gonna keep blocking like this. They can also they can prevent one, and they can deal three. So like, oh god, the amount of extra damage we have to have here. Come on, dude. Oh, 
Look at all those, all the prevention shields. Oh, it's funny because it's us too. That's actually kind of cool. Um, oh god, I don't like doing this at all. So they prevent one, so we gotta deal six to it, and if they kill one of their two blockers... Should be able to take care of the Phyrexian Juggernaut. It's only a, like a three for one, so that seems good. And they only still have six cards in hand. If they have any removal here, it's just a blowout. It's just an utter blowout, but like we can't just keep waiting for this guy to to come through. Also, if all three of these guys die, maybe our Toxic Stench gets better soon. Who knows? Mm. You should snipe Caleb. Yeah, probably not. Probably should not do that. Yep, that's what we were afraid of. Yep, that's a good one. Your toxic stench should get better if you take a shower. Wow. That's aggressive. Wow, this is unbelievable. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 lands out of 20 cards. Not including Simic Signet, Avacyn's Pilgrim, and Verdant Haven. This is actually ridiculous. Come on, if he didn't want us hanging to hang out in there, we wouldn't he wouldn't be streaming. That's a good point. Well you kind of made it you kind of like you, you kind of made Made me, I don't even know what the dude said. I literally can't even paraphrase the dude. It's free real estate. What'd you say? It's free real estate. Free real estate? Mm hmm. What does that mean? You know what that mean? No. For shame. I don't feel like this is good. We're just going to actually concede here and go to the next game. Like, this game is f unbelievably bad. <clears throat> Ours is blueprints next turn. We would have drawn a card. Could have drawn Echoing Truth to bounce that guy. We pay for the blueprints, draw that. We draw into Fiend Slayer Paladin, which doesn't actually do anything for us. Alright, do we have an artifact removal spell? Pro Red seems actually pretty good here. All right, destroy an enchantment and each other enchantment. Okay, that's cool. Bramble crush. It destroys a non-creature. Oh yeah. Yeah. Destroy creatures flying. All right. Well. Luminous wake on a uh, <laughs> on a Phyrexian juggernaut's pretty funny because you're just like, all right, gain four, take five poison. Ah, well, that's unfortunate. Take it easy, buddy. Maybe Pista Strike? Also, Celestial Porch could be okay, depending on what they have. They did have, they did have red. Mm. I'll just bring in the Strike. I know they have a Flyer, so... I got banned from his chat for even saying I'd stream some. I don't know why you would say that though. Like it's not funny. It's not a funny joke. Like it's actually. Sounds pretty bad. Sounds good. Oh, oh wow. Yeah, sure. That's why we need. <laughs> Bustin' makes me feel good. <laughs> I was, I was getting bored, so let's see if anyone's streaming. Here we are. For all your busting needs. It's good stuff, man. Makes you feel good. Ooh, now you can attack for two.
Uh, if you so if you here's the thing, uh, spicy fart. If you think that getting the best plays, if if you think you're getting the best plays from the chat, um, you I don't think you've ever watched a streamer ever. <laughs> I think you actually have no concept of what streaming is and uh, what comes out of the chat. Stream sniping is very deliberate. Stream chat. I actually did a whole I did a whole thing about this, a whole podcast about this. It's un, it's just such an unbelievably like un like like poorly thought out ignorant c opinion to compare like something you deliberately do like so i'm gonna i'm gonna consciously go to your stream with no other intention but to cheat off you it's 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 how is it both cheats though one you can't really avoid one is not intentional whatsoever one is literally completely avoiding it except for the fact that you're streaming which means that you can't really avoid it and by trying to avoid it, it means you have, just have to not stream in general. He was like, I, I don't stream because there's no way to avoid the chat literally just talking to me. Also, the chat is often wrong. Chat is constantly wrong, which is like you're just as likely to get a bad play as you are to get a good play. So it's, it's completely, let alone, there are so many times I make a mistake and misplay because the chat, because I'm literally reading the chat, interacting, and I'm like, oh, I forgot to do this. I misclicked. It's like, it's... <laughs> Play kiss starting Caleb. Here you go, buddy. I got this for you. Like anyone who thinks chat is an advantage just really doesn't like they're just they're just they're not arguing in good faith. Both are against the rule. Like how can they like no? What? That doesn't even make sense. Return target card from your your hand, clash with an opponent if you win, untap or forest to control. Mountain and weight of consciousness. God, I want this, but I really just want to land too. It's literally, stream sniping is literally in the terms of service. Uh, you you can't put don't chat to people in the terms of service. That doesn't make any sense. Yep. Well, this is unfortunate. Here we go. Not, not going to draw any of our lands now. Frank lost the match because he squirted Mike in the face. Yeah, no, you were like, oh, squirt him again, and I did it. And then I accidentally clicked on the, the on OK, and I just misclicked through something I really wanted to do. So I actually don't understand this argument that, like... I get that you might think it breaks the spirit of, like, the game or whatever, but, like... I mean, I, I don't think it does. Yeah, it's, it's just nonsense. Whenever it deals combat damage to a creature, destroy it. All right, I like it. Are you saying that when we discuss scotch for an hour, that doesn't improve your game? I am. I am indeed saying that. I'm also saying that you guys should sit in silence and I should sit in silence and uh, because that's the way magic is meant to be played. It just doesn't make any sense. It's just like arguing for the sake of arguing, I think. It's really silly. Gains flying and pro green and white. That could be good. We could discard our whole hand to turn on this threshold. Ooh, worth it. There was a lot of discarding back in this block, which is kind of funny. I, I just, just I hate getting into the the whole stream sniping versus whatever conversation because it's like I feel like the people who are supported in any way are just on the wrong side of history. You're just like it just doesn't make sense. Walladell, I did not start. I did not stop the stream at any point. No, I did not. I did not. You totally got debated, buddy. Which is pretty sad. I feel like you should know better by now. Oh, it's old Foxy. Foxy. There we go. Foxy. 
yeah when people are like oh you should cast this and it's like it's during their turn and it's like during combat and it's a sorcery and i'm like yeah it doesn't work like that and i literally spend 10 minutes on the stream telling telling people that this this card does not work the way you think it works but yeah tell me more about how chat is a, an advantage yeah this guy is pretty good actually we can just block right we destroy that creature can't be regenerated yeah let's do that i'll do it I don't even know how you did that one. I don't even know how it happened. That's amazing. Well, it did. I'm impressed. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. This seems like a good trade, I guess. Whenever it deals combat damage to a creature, destroy that creature, it can't be regenerated. Oh, this is what you're going to do with your life? Oh, and I don't have Predator Strike. That's absolutely incredible. I'm just going to lose both games to a Phyrexian Juggernaut. Seems likely. Or you guys can just wait around because I sign off permanently. Like, after I end the YouTube video, I'll end it again. I'll actually say goodbye to all you guys when I'm done. Like, I don't actually just leave after the YouTube video ever, so I don't know why... You would leave after that anyway, because I never do that. Literally never. Yep, yeah, just gonna pass here and hope we draw any card that can deal with. Oh, that's a card. So we're getting back grotesque, which is good. We can either keep up Stench or Predator Strike. Probably Predator Strike. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I don't think we're close to casting this guy. I literally don't even know what that person said. I mean, if you played against Gabby with LSV coaching her, like, that's not a that's not a stream issue. Like, that's literally someone sitting... Like, you can't stop that. Like, if I wasn't streaming, I could still be sitting here playing with Mike B, and Mike could still tell me the play to make. Like, you, this is two completely different issues that you're conflating. I mean, if if your if your opinion is magic is a two player game, like, I mean, I guess the streaming shouldn't exist. Like, that's the bottom line. Like, that's literally what it comes down to, because you can't have streaming exist and also have chat along with it, and then have it be a two player game. Like, that's just never going to happen. There's no. So you have to just accept the fact that people in the chat are going to spout out their opinions and say things, and like you can either you can either be upset about that for the rest of your life. And, and feel like it's unfair to you. Um, or you can just deal with it. Like, it's just not a big deal. I don't even know what that is. What is this dude? Barricade Black attacks each combat, so it's just a 7-5, just a big fat 7-5 idiot. 
One, two, three, four, five. We can discard these two to turn on. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, God, how close are we to this? Like, not close at all, right? Six cards in the graveyard. All right, well, we're getting somewhere. Nine mana. Freaky ghosts. I'm just going to block here because this actually puts this guy in the graveyard. And uh, we can Toxic Stench. I also have the mana free this turn. And I don't know if I'll have it free on another turn. So we can just get rid of this guy. Also, if Caleb doesn't play anything, we can kill this guy. And then set up something else if we want to. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Two mana away from a path raiser. So if we hit two lands, okay. If we hit spells forever that's okay too wait why didn't this die what am i missing what the It just didn't work, apparently. Seven more cards are in your graveyard. No, there's no alternate mode. It's a threshold card. Wow. Oh, Magic Online. Do, 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 do. You are a fine program. One more land, we get a Path Razor log. All right, so we're going to alt print screen that bad boy. Nope, not that one. This one. All right, that was fun. Here, I'll give you a neg one, neg one. I was like, wait, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. It says seven right here. I don't know, or seven right, it said seven down there. Now it just says nine because Oh my god, Magic Online. Jesus. Get your life together. No, those look like enchantments to me, dog. I'll just play for free, dog. I'm sure Ulamog does bug too. It's probably going to be like, oh, did you mean a negative nine, negative nine? And then it just dies. Look at this aggression. Flight of Fancy one time. Buskin makes me feel good. Oh, that was a good draw. Buskin? Mm -hmm. Honey Buskin? We can't even attack because then they just prevent the one damage to everything. They just block and then prevent. 
This doesn't even float. I thought this floated, because look at it. Let's be real. Probably going to strike this dude, because why not? Mike, I didn't know you played music on the street. Do you? Bah. Wow. That's just sad. Wow. Wait. No. It doesn't matter. Yeah. Alright, well, if that was a regular land, we could have played Pathraiser, but instead it was a card we replaced the land with in our deck. I'm doing an office tree night on Friday, so I've been setting up on tree. Oh, well, that's good. I don't think we can race that, unfortunately. Oh, that'll that'll help. Got him. It's your big boy. Bustin' makes me feel good. That guy's indestructible, right? No. Oh. So he's probably dead. Yep, yeah, there you go. <laughs> Unbelievable. Oh man, Absolver Thrall. Actually, being able to bounce this and the guard duty is pretty good. Why don't you just ramp. bounce your guy and then kill the guard duty? That's probably a better play. Because I was figuring to get, a, get an attack out of it. But you, you're probably right. Oh, actually, oh, we could have bounced this guy and the spirit, replayed this guy, and then attacked this turn. That would have been, oh man, that would have been so good. Cheater, Mike gave you the play. Yeah, and then I still came up with a better play, and I didn't. I didn't do. Yeah, I didn't do the better play. Didn't do either of them. So, well, yet. Bustin, 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 bustin. Yeah, that seems good. Can't you guys are the defendee? Uh, what does that mean? Like this guy? Yes. Yes, we can. Taunt him. Haunt him and taunt him. Well, this is this doesn't bode well. Oh, for crying out loud! Put him in the pooper. Kill shot. Oh, kill shots in the graveyard. So that's nice. This is sad because like it, he's gonna deal eighteen originally. But with the uh, with the prevent in two turns, oh, that's interesting. I mean, are we dead? Why would you sack this guy over a land? That's really interesting. No, well, that explains it. I wonder if we passed Caleb the planar cleansing. I would not be surprised if he was in our pod. One, two, three, four, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Fourteen lands. There are three lands and fourteen cards. It's pretty good. Yeah, you just get back Moldervine Cloak and kill me, right? Yep. It's pretty simple. Yep. This game would have went uh, pretty much differently. We would have had a Sentinel Spider the entire game, which has Reach and Vigilance, which can block his flyers. Uh, I think this game would have went significantly differently had the Toxic Stench worked. All right. Well, that is unfortunate. Better make sure to uh, 
Submitty the Tiki. Request reimbursement because I don't like Submitty the Tiki, as Mike B would say. Oh, let's submit a request. Would you like to con? Uh, what? No, I want to actually click this one. There we go. There you go. Join. Quit igging me, mum. That's a good one. Quit igging me, mum. I don't know what that is. Do you know what that is? Yeah, you quit egging your mom. I don't. Know. <laughs> it's it's really obvious. Frank, I don't always flood, but it sure does seem like a friggin' lot lapore. That's uh, please don't capitalize the P in my last name. But yeah, I got I got you. I will keep. I'll capitalize all letters. How about that? Okay, I accept that. Yeah, having just a 4-4 Sentinel Spider in that game, instead of not having it, is pretty unbelievably bad. Especially when, like, most of the damage was dealt with a 2-3 and a 1-1 one, one that we could easily block. Oh, we don't have a third land, so I'm just going to play Signet here. You guys are ridiculous. This is why you guys can't have nice things. Mm, yep, that's a good one. That is a sweetie boy. A sweetie boy! Mm hmm. I still gotta have dinner after this. You don't have dinner yet, man? No, nah, man. Man, that's crazy. Grave Tiller Worm. 4 4 if it enters the battlefield with 1 4 1. So it's an 8 8 trampler if they have morbid. Oh, God. Instant creature land. Okay, so they don't have Morbid yet. That's still pretty scary. Sweetie boy oh, going God, to they the took corner it. store. Sweetie boy, Sweetie going. Sweetie boy going to the corner store. Sweetie boy's going there now? I'm just quoting the chat. Is that what they said? They talking about that Sweetie boy? It's your Sweetie boy. Oh, it's this A's ring. Sweetie boy going to the corner store. Something to bounce that echoing truth. <coughs> Morbid isn't delirium. Maybe you should listen. What does that even mean? I don't understand what's going on right now. Morbid is when a creature die. Morbid is, yeah. Morbid is if a creature died. Delirium is having four card types in the graveyard. Did I say morbid? I meant delirium. You guys know what I meant. Did that guy have morbid or did he have you delirium? Idiot. Oh dang, I actually don't know which one that guy has. Oh, I think it has morbid though, because they're they're throwing this guy into here, so they're gonna be like, oh dang. I thought it was delirium. It's morbid, now we're just gonna bounce it. Oh, morbid's worse. That seems like it's so much easier to trigger. Crying out loud. Sweetie boy, that sweetie boy is going to the corner store. Swamp. I'm going to cycle you, idiot. <laughs> Did you like that? I'm going to cycle you, idiot. What All did he ever right. do to you? He was your best friend. He wasn't my best friend. Wow. My best friend is dead, Michael. Sweetie boy going to the corner store. All right, this is match 2077 28982, is that right? 28982, yes. Type of event. League draft. Subject. Toxic. Stench. Is broken. Oh, Torrent of Souls, this... Oh, whenever a lander is a battlefield, create a 1-1. One, one. He's got landfall. Back before landfall was real. And a winding constrictor, okay. Alright. We're having a good time. Still no land. Fantastic. You got enough for Convoke? For... No. Nope. We don't have enough to literally do anything. We can cast nothing except for this guy, which doesn't really do anything. That's great. Sweetie boy going to the corner store. Does block one ones pretty well. Cool. (laughs) 
Give them that sad face. I always put sad faces in my, like, email requests for things. Like, if I have a customer service request, I always put a sad face. So, so they know I'm sad. Why didn't they just play the fatty boy again? Hey, sweetie boy going to the corner store. Now you can play your worm. Or my sentinel spider. Yes. So they have three cards, one of them is this idiot? Okay. Sweetie boy. Is he going to the corner store? What did you say to me? The sweetie boy going to the corner store. I don't know what he's doing, man. I'm not I'm not my sweetie boy's keeper. Hmm. Fantastic. Oh, the double Harabe's whisper deck in the chaos draft. Friggin' fantastic. That's like cheating, basically. This doesn't even do what we want it to do. We'll just take five. That is utterly ridiculous, actually. Yeah, boy. Actually, maybe we just play a Siege Worm. I want to be able to draw here. I think we can take a hit. Ugh, I'm going to get fired tomorrow because my boss is going to be like, how was your weekend? And I'm going to be like, sweetie boy, going to the corner <laughs> store. And they're going to be like, pack up your things and leave. Don't you dare go to the corner store. Not on our watch, buddy. Michael B's going to the corner store. I guess we'll just save this and send it to him. The old save and send. A classic, Michael. Save it as a JPEG. I'll save it as a little untitled boy. Add a file untitled. Yep, this horse is getting real aggressive here. Oh yeah! Oh yeah! I don't really want to get rid of this guy because we got bigger fish to fry. Why don't they have any enchantments? Why aren't they replaying this again? I don't understand what's happening. Do they not know about the sweetie boy and going to the corner store? What well, percentage of corner stores are actual on corners? Uh, all of them. That's why they're called corner stores. <laughs> Duh. Dummies. If we play this, it's really committing our next two turns. I think we just have to play War Marino. Hey, you're crazy. You can't play blueprints. Don't talk to me like a like a blueprint. <laughs> Harabi's whisper number three. Or you try? It's just not our day, guys. It is not our day. Bass all bear and a riddle made of concrete. Again. If we can get this guy down, I feel fine blocking here. I mean, they got double Harabi's Whisper and Putrefy in their deck, so that's pretty cool. And a five, it's okay. And turn it to your to the battlefield and sacrifice a creature. Wow, that's a good combo. Oh, here now. Have another Michael in a summer. Michael days, yeah. Okay, here.
Wish you could target their guys with this. That'd be cool. That would be cool. Who knew? This horse would be so good. My toxic stench is broken. Ba boom 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 ba boom ba boom boom ba 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 boom boom. Let's see if you have another piece of removal spell in your three card hand, one of which is a big fat grave tiller piece of garbage. Oh my god, are you serious right now? Shut up and take my money. <sighs> I just want to die right now. I'm just absolutely done. There's nothing I can draw that I really care about here. Yep, no black mana. That doesn't do it. Cool. So just mono removal dot deck, mono big fat idiot dot deck. Okay. Oh, Celestial Purge seems pretty good here. I'm gonna just bring that dude in and not even care. Man. I'm gonna take Absolver Thrill out. That guy seems pretty bad. This guy got first strike too? No, just pro red? Okay. Okay. That's a from a different time, Frank. <laughs> what, first strike? Mm-hmm. What different time was it? My dad. Oh, it was your dad different time. Quit playing Magic for Night and play Super Mario 2 instead. I do like a good Super Mario 2. That is the creepiest of the Marios. Is that the one with the turnips? Yeah. And you would go down in the front and like grab them, pull them up. Two corner store bucks. That's really all I've ever wanted. Haven't had any notifications in a while, Bits. I don't even think I've seen those. Yeah, things quieted down after that first draft. Uh, no, you will stay on the top. Boop, 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 boop. You like this song? It's okay. That's okay. It wasn't originally a Mario game? Also, I don't know why that makes it the worst. But I, I am curious to hear that it, it wasn't a Mario game. That doesn't... Interesting. Look at this little friggin' weirdo, man. Oh, God. Magic is a weird game sometimes. No wonder people think Magic is a demon game. No, man, he's a little cutie. Man, what would your mom do if she went in your bedroom and saw this card? She'd probably be like, that's a little cutie. <laughs> she would definitely not be that. She'd be like, Michael, that's terrifying. That's obviously the work of the devil. Just like you. You're the work of the devil. No, I just work for the devil. Do you? Mm hmm. <laughs> Doki Doki Panic? Oh my god, really? Oh my god. That's amazing. Boop 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 boop. I think we'll just take five here and I'll try to cycle the hundred. Time to set Michael on fire. <laughs> oh, well. I want to bounce both these guys, actually. See you later, bye. Land? Black card. Close. Was it? Yeah. Was it? Yeah, use that ability. Heck yeah. Woot woot! Hoo to hoo! Did you hear my what woot hoo to hoo? Good talk, man. Good talk. Keep scratching. Keep scratching your dirty face. You friggin... Uh, I'll have you know it's a clean face. Prove it. Can't. You win this round. Got him. 
Dirty. What do you think the odds are my creatures are going to survive? So they have three removal spells in hand, undoubtedly, and we have two creatures, so it's not going to be good. Mm hmm. 666 mom walks into my room with two priests because I am playing the devil's card game bits. <laughs> nice. I'm a fan. Man, everybody knows Mega Man's known as Rock Man. Jump and shoot, man. How long is this guy going to survive when they have Harabi's Whisper, Harabi's Whisper, Putrefy? I think this draft is, uh... Riding on cars. <laughs> no, the draft isn't riding on cars. Are you riding on cars? Sometimes. When have you ridden on a car? Every day. So so today? Yeah, I've ridden on a car. You rode on a car today? Yeah. When? When I got my sub. When you got your sub? Mm-hmm. Huh. Mike, who's your favorite commander of the 2018? Um... I think the Esper one's pretty cool. What's your favorite commander, Michael? Is it Esperito? Esperito. Nicholas Esperito. You know Esperito. Few people know the original Mega Man was going to be called Shooty McJump Face. That's true. I don't think many people do know that. Tell me about you riding on your car adventure. Did you not drive in your car? You rode on top of it? No, I rode on my car. On it? Yeah. So on top of it? Well, in a sense. <laughs> I mean, you have to be on top of your car to be in it. Do you? Yeah. I'm on top of the seat. So therefore, I'm on top of the car. There's a certain pain I'm feeling right now. It's very strong. <laughs> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We're going for it. Land me. Dang it. <sighs> boom, boom, boom. I don't understand what's going on in not X Mega Man X box art. Oh, in the Mega Man box art. You know what they're doing. They're riding on cars. They're riding on... Are they going to putrefy this? Do you ride on top of a convertible? Yeah, I think so. Mm -hmm. I would say yes. You ride on top of all cars. I'm a car. Greg, can you ride on top of me? No. Well... That's probably for the best. Urza's Blupper Prince. I will pay for this. I'll draw in response, though. I'm not too scared about the pressure we got going on here, so... And we got Echoing Truth and Predator Strike. You know that Predator. Boom, ba -doom, ba -doom. See, they gave him a little pistol in the box art. Oh, God. Here we go. Oh, yeah. This art's weird. This was the old, the like, the, the regular NES version. And I was always like, this isn't what's happening. Why does the art look like this? Five, six, seven, eight mana, so you can activate this guy twice to make him a six six. Hmm. Hmm. What's that noise? I don't know. I think it's probably the turtle tank sucking up air. Game Krang, thank you so much for the sub. Really appreciate it. Welcome back. Fifteen months in a row is a ridiculous amount of time. Turtle tank probably needs air, so it's suck it's we need water, so it's sucking up more air. And it's being aggressively loud about it. Yeah, you got it. I'll take four. From your Zoloft shade. Oh, now we just get to draw forever though. Boop, 
I like our mono spider deck. Me too. I don't want to attack into this. I just don't feel like we're in good position here. Wait, how many spiders do we have? Oh, two? We only got two spiders, man. I'd go down to the corner store and buy Famicom games for $2. Wow, that's pretty good. Kerwit going to the corner store. Oh, God. What is this? Nine mana, huh? Artisan of Kozilek. You can return a creature from your graveyard. Sure, that's fine. I don't know if it's fine. I don't care about it. Do you? You should. Why? It's got Annihilator Toes. Annihilator Toes? Yeah. Toe Annihilator? As far as I'm concerned, that just fills my graveyard, brah. In an extreme way, yes. I mean, we've got a lot of lands. Big Mike going to the corner store. So what do we got? Four, five, six, seven lands. We can play. We can keep up Stench and all of these three by just playing this guy. Big Michael going to the corner store. We didn't have corner stores. Can't have corner stores. We don't have roads. Man. No roads. Toe Annihilator? That's a ten turn clock. Oh look, another. Another big fat thing you're going to play here. That's unfortunate. I'll sack two forests. I don't even care. One, two, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We only have ten mana, so we'll go down to n eleven. N eleven. What did you say to me? N eleven. Where we're going, we don't need roads. That is a true story. What if I just put all my guys in front of it? Is that the way we wanted to do? Sweet Michael going to the corner store. So we got four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Just everybody. Just put them all in the front. Let them figure it out. I don't even care anymore. My chair is like rolling away and I'm really not okay with it. Are you pushing it? Nope. I could see you doing that. That's like a thing you could do. You just gotta get your foot on my chair. Alright, now you are. Why are you the way that you are? No, I feel like you're asking for it. Wow. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And then you're in this guy, you're killing four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, my Harabi is a whisper. Harabi is a whisper. So now we can bounce you and then kill you. That seems actually pretty okay. Sweet man's going to the corner store. This will be seven cards in our yard. Oh wait, it doesn't work. This isn't going to work, is it? Probably not. Oh my god. Maybe it's a different situation. Magic Online's weird. Yep. It doesn't even give it neg one. No, it did. It did give it neg one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, that's so dumb, dude. I, this game is actually unbelievable. I totally forgot it was actually not going to work. I was like, oh, this is going to be great. You should just take it out of our deck. It's not good. Yeah, you're right, actually. You're right. Get out of here. And get out of here, Absolver Thrall, too. You suck, too. Zombie giant? More like cringe giant. <laughs> He's just fine. What? Are you serious? His stats are completely acceptable. Chris, you said something I didn't even see it, buddy. Get 
Get that spider out? This one? This one? These are our best creatures, man. Those really are our best creatures. I'm not joking. Yeah, this is rough. Shut up and take my money. One Super Mario 2 buck. That's very random. Oh, boy. It's not good. What are you talking about, man? We're living the dream. We're 0 and 2. What do we got to lose? Well, I'm definitely 40 getting, play points. getting this entry back, so that's true. Well, 30, because you get 10 if you lose. So. Ah. Ah. Well, what a surprise. Was it? What a nice prize. Was it? It was okay. The Amazing Spooderman. <laughs> it's funny because people do, who don't know what you're looking at, they just said that randomly. What's wrong with that? I guess nothing, man. I will play first. I will keep this hand. Okay. Well, that's all I wanted to know. Well, sweet Mike going to the corner store. Wow, you finally saw Infinity War. Good lord, man. Look, they're already one-upping us. Oh, I have a guild gate. Are you jelly of his guild gate? Heck yeah, I am. Mummy Paramount. When another zombie enters it, it gets 1-1. One, one. <laughs> I'm laughing at the way I accidentally said that. When a zombie enters it, it gets 1-1. One, one. Oh, I should have put a thing on this. I'm not playing my best because we're 0-2 right now, and uh, I'm starving right now. So, What are you going to get, man? I'm going to just make some food. Huh. Sometimes when you ask me questions like that... I actually wonder if you actually are aware of the concept of making food as a thing. <laughs> You're like, what are you going to get? I'm like, well, it's 11 p.m., so I'm probably just going to have to I don't know here. your life. Yeah, but I, that, it's because it's you default to it. I'm like, huh. I don't think you know that you can cook food in the house. I ain't never done it. you never seen Avatar? Avatar is pretty good. And I'm okay keeping... Wow, that's aggressive. Looks real pretty. God, we're still playing that guy? Not still. We just added him. This oh. is the first time we've ever had this guy in the deck. Ew. Yeah, that's what... Oh, cool. They anyways, killed so it. That's cool. Yeah, that's cool. <laughs> oh, God. We did it, boys. Nailed it. All right. Let's see if we can... Uh, let's see if we can literally not win a game. We're on a good record so far. For Boy, that. we are killing it. Some chocolate milk. I want some chocolate milk. <laughs> Do you have any? No. Huh. Well, that's a real bummer, man. Bummer, man. Bummer, man. I wonder what you do. Just go get some, obviously. Where are you going to go? To the corner store. Oh, yeah. Mike B is going to the corner store. Michael B. I was talking about the James Cameron. Yeah, who wasn't? Oh, because CTB asked. Never mind. I was like, yeah, everybody knows that. <laughs> Well, I can't play both of these, so I guess we'll just play 
gentleman here. I'm talking about the TV show, not the movie. What's going on right now? The movie was terrible. I forgot who I watched that with. Doesn't matter. Still bad. That noise also could be like Hunter snoring or something, so. No, Hunter's like right there. Oh, yeah, you're right. I actually just heard him. That's a good card. Sweet Michael going to the corner store. It does sound like a snore, right? A little bit. The Stick. twist in the movie should have been that you got your money back. <laughs> a twist! Here's your refund. Really? But I didn't ask for a refund. You, you did by you, seeing the movie. You knew we did it. You knew we did? You knew we did. That's good. I'm just going to kill this guy. Okay. If he dies, he dies. Can I get a swamp? Not bad. It's only three in the deck. The odds aren't happening. Or... They're not high. Unlike me. <laughs> Don't tap my woodland changeling, bro. Don't tap old Woody. Oh, it's random. That's unfortunate. That was the guy I wanted. For obvious reasons. Guess we could have discarded them both. And then they jokes on them. Can we just get there with this grotesque hybrid? We could certainly try. Probably not. Don't you remember you told me you loved me, baby? Says you're becoming Magnus where you can, baby. 2-5 is pretty strong. Me and Mike are busy watching the uh, the People vs. O.J. Simpson. Which was a uh, an FX show and now it's on Netflix. It's, it's pretty good. It's my second time watching it, but it's still pretty good. Which is why I'm watching a second time. It'd be weird if it was bad and you were watching a second yeah, time. Yeah, then I'm just like, I don't like it. I do not lack. So, we can't get through this guy. Huh. Well. Okay, we got that 3-3 three, three trample. Or. Trample. Er. Shut up and take my money. What up, kind buds? One at the corner store right now, Buck. Are you at the corner store right now? Because that's hilarious if you're at the corner store, still watching the stream, and still donating a buck because of your corner store corner storeness. I'm just going to block and kill it. So long, little Swamperino. Hey, that guy actually did something. It's a big boy. You're a big boy. Yes. It's me, big boy. Well, we're going to play a spooter now. And done. Where's the Absolver Thrall now? Oh, yeah, I took it out. And we only have six mana because we discarded this. 
good times. Everything is all right, spiders. Mm. Jump in through your window tonight. Wow, really? Oh, OJ Made in America. I don't think I've seen that. Oh, that looks great. All right, well, that's blue. So in future turns, that will be nice. Prevent the one's next one damage that will be dealt to any target this turn. Prevent all damage that will be dealt to target legendary creature this turn. Sure. Stop tapping my grotesque hybrid down. Look at this thing. This art's great, actually. It's Teresa Nielsen, so I guess that makes sense. It's like an Egyptian centaur zombie. It's ten hours? I guess, yeah, but the thing is, like... The o People vs. O.J. Simpson, which is a show, is also kind of like 13 hours because it's like 10 or 12 episodes. Given your humans plus two, plus two. So, so you don't have Frank, to. Frank, you should check out O.J.'s book. It's a real killer. Oh my god. <laughs> oh god. I would, I would assume O.J. did not write it himself. Ugh. <sighs> I was watching an extra tape years back where OJ was showing his how to throw punches and literally said, this is the one you use on your wife? Oh, wow. That's amazing. That's disgusting. Oh, God. I don't think this guy does anything, right? Now, I was going to play it because it, it blocks it. It gets through the 3-6 with Exalt, but now I don't even think it does. And now I just want to get rid of it and draw. What up, Kellen? Good seeing you, buddy. You look a land. Six, seven. Yeah, we're getting close. Only three lands shy. We're three lands shy, shy. Hush, hush, I do I. The funny thing is they can actually attack with this guy. We can go three, four, five, six, and they just prevent one, and it's like... It's my worm. It's my worm. It's, it's my, my worm. worm. Wow, that's <laughs> that's amazing. You can ring my worm. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, right? Oh, oh, you can tell because it's highlighted that it didn't actually register. Oh, the untapped the swamp too. That's a good one. That's eh, a good boy. What are the odds this guy survives? Zero, right? Calculating. One percent. One percent. So you're saying there's a chance. I'm back from the corner store. Did I miss something? No, because you were here the whole time. Kerwitz thinging at the corner store. Once, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Two away. We're getting there. Hey man, what's the going to? Wawa? Maybe. 7 Eleven? Who knows? Well, I, I'd hope you do. I hope you know. I'll figure it out. What's it gonna be? You missed him ringing his. <laughs> oh, you could discard the regen, the Eldrazi guy to the regen guy. That's true. I could do that. Wawa is greater than 7-Eleven, I believe. Yeah, but we're just going to buy chocolate milk. I don't think it matters. Chocolate milk. Why don't you just? Why, don't you, why wouldn't you just get a milkshake if you're going to the? Like, if I was going to get a, a big old thing of chocolate milk, I'd probably just get a milkshake instead. Well, chocolate milk is cheaper. Chocolate milk's going to the corner store. You can get more of it. Oh, I did the terrible. I. Oh God, this is why chat. This is why anyone who's like. Oh, it's so much better to play. Like you're just doing a thing. Like I just literally screwed up, and and this guy just traded for nothing. Because I'm thinking about chocolate milk and milkshakes. This has not been an ideal draft. I apologize for you guys watching. If you guys are not enjoying the uh, the train wreck that has been established here, 
And it's not even because they did anything wrong. It's not like chat did something actively wrong. It's just a matter of like, it's a distraction. And uh, that should be obvious to people who are criticizing chat advice. Yep. Every land being two guys is pretty good. Oh my god, all I had to do is... This is one more land. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right, one more and we got it. Our board's fine. Like, I feel like we're okay. Until we're just going to tap it with... Oh, that's right. I forgot the... <laughs> I'm so excited about playing my guy. Well, you know what? I think it is a, a meme stream first and a, and a magic stream second. I think that's fair. I also do think both of the games would have been completely different if the Toxic Stench worked. I think it's just a... We, we basically don't have a removal spell in our deck that we thought we had. Wow. Well, can't block this guy, so I guess I'll take three. This card's surprisingly good right now. Hmm. Fascinating. Oh, that's not made. Now we're getting somewhere. Oh, biscuits. Oh, biscuits. Oh, biscuits. You came and you found me a biscuit. Wow. And then you took four damage and then you printed one of it. So good. Now we get a Fiend Slayer Paladin down. Oh! <laughs> oh! Oh! Wilbur. Bustin' does make you feel good. You were right. Hunter, where are you going? Where, yeah? Where is he going? Where are you at? There you are. Are we in the combat step? Or are you just attacking with this guy again? No blocks. I'll take another three. I got a Fiend Slayer Paladin. Bustin' makes me feel good. Hey man, when you go to 7-Eleven, can you pick us up some O biscuits? What are those? You know the O biscuit? No. Oh biscuit, you know it. Don't be a little Mitch. Oh, that's pretty good. How did we not hit an eleventh land? I don't understand. Because it's hard to hit 11 mana. I'm about to bust. <laughs> I think we Quicksilver guys are our Sentinel Spider. And... Littering. And... Smoking the Reefer. <laughs> I ain't afraid of no ghost. You should be. You will be. Give me them sweet, sweet life points, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Well, that's three. I got first strike. What you know about my first strike? Oh, four? Oh, five. Oh, six. Oh, biscuits. Wow, all of them dudes. I will assign it like this, and we will strike while the iron is hot. I'm pretty sure I'm black spells. Yep, prevent damage to that guy, sure. Uh, yeah, it doesn't matter. One, two, three, four. Yeah, five are going to die. Where did all your gentlemen go? <laughs> Do 
<laughs> oh god. No idea why I'm thinking about this. I imagine it's because the 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 cookie talk, but you know, what are you going to do? Cookie talk. Cookie talk. Time to just block here. Do a little cookie block if you know what I mean. No. No? No. No. Are we going to win this game? It's looking like it. So weird. I feel like our opponent could navigate this game better than one. Golden Warriors are delicious. You shut your mouth. Do you prefer the Goldens? I don't know if I prefer them, but I think they're very good. I like the vanilla cookie. I don't know. I'm a vanilla cookie fan. What can I say? I don't actually think we need that, to be honest. Well, um, no, I think it's actually fine. That'll do. You know, next turn. I just like the contrast between the chocolate and the cream. The chocolate and the cream. <laughs> guess we got him with that one i like the chocolate i don't like okay so the one thing i don't like about chocolate oreos is that they they have a real crumbly taste to them like it almost tastes like tastes like you're eating some dirt tastes like you're eating dirt man well why don't we compare the two you'll i'll give you a handful of dirt and i'll give you an oreo cookie and you tell me which one's better oh please do that michael i want the dirty oreo cookie <laughs> stop using that voice it's extremely creepy do you don't like my voice michael mint oreos are op otherwise known as no i guess they're not known as grasshoppers grasshoppers are like an actual they're their own cookie from the keebler elves i believe i don't think i've had reverse oreos So I think we're going to play just Spider Sentinel here because it's just a better creature. And if we draw a land, we can still play Path Razor. <laughs> bustin, 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 bustin. Oh, I wonder what that is. Probably an Exalted Angel. But they're specially crafted by Keebler Elves. I always wondered why Golden Warriors are still on the shelves. This stream explains it. Yeah, I am their core demographic. How do Snickers Ice Cream Bars... That's interesting. What? Really? Well, they're not... A Snickers Ice Cream Bar is not a Snickers. That's just frozen. It's a different product. Sure. But so I'm just surprised that it would have less calories. Because ice cream is fat. Ice cream is fat. <laughs> you are fat, ice cream. Oh my god, what are you doing? Tap two creatures. Oh, it doesn't have entwine, so that's okay. Alright, so you're just tapping these guys? Well then. I'm actually tempted to blinding light this guy. Because I don't know what it is. Actually, maybe I just get rid of this guy, right? Look at all this mana I'm getting, man. God, I'm so mana rich. Yeah, a lot of good it's doing you. How dare you? How dare you talk to me like that? I mean, ice cream is fat, but peanuts and caramel are fat and sugar. Isn't ice cream also fat and sugar? Aren't they? So both of those things are the same then, right? All that means to me is that for now and I'll only buy ice cream Snickers as opposed to regular Snickers. If your opponent was in fact sniping this game, he would have just passed out and vomited on himself from the sheer deranged nonsense going on right now. What did you say about Snickers? I should only buy ice cream Snickers. They're more healthy. Yeah, they're more healthy. <laughs> That's really the lesson to take away here. Is that it's more healthy. It's a healthier product. Yeah. So, you know, if you're going for a health-conscious lifestyle, 
choose ice cream Snickers bars. Ice cream Snickers bars, guys. That's the way to go. I'm not blocking this idiot. Am I evil for thinking Nutella is trash? Yeah. Well, I don't know if you're evil. I would just think your taste buds are kind of messed up. I'm yeah, not saying that Nutella is necessarily better than peanut butter, but Nutella is amazing. It's better than peanut butter. How do you feel about cashew butter? I don't think I've ever had cashew butter. Pretty good. American Nutella? Is there a difference? Oh, he did the thing where they don't untap. Oh, that's interesting. Wait. Oh, they did entwine. It does have entwine. Okay, well, that's cool. Well, my my bad. American Nutella. America. Jojo MK, America. thanks so much for the resub. Really appreciate it. Welcome back. I wish we had more things to do with flyers or artifacts, man. America. America. Coming again to say the most Hey, man. I got mac and cheese at Publix. And it was like at the end of the mac and cheese, so all of it was like crispy and crunchy. So good. <laughs> So good. That was a cool story, man. Thanks, bro. I look forward to hearing more about your mac and cheese adventures sometime. Oh, I'll keep you updated. Boy, I need to go eat some food after this. Oh, I didn't want a mulligan! You can definitely tell he needs to eat some food because that was not a mulligan hand. But this hand's still pretty good, so Wasn't we're going to... first hand, like, one land? No, it had a land and a wildfire border post. Oh, yeah, that was pretty good. Oh! Did you hear it? Oh! oh! Mac and cheese pizza pops? What the frig is that? I don't know, but I like the sound of it. Look at this guy. I'm over here with my Sarah Ascendant over here. Everybody knows, everybody knows American chocolate is trash. One Mike B story time buck. Hey man, I went to Publix and I got some mac and cheese. And they were at the end of the mac and cheese. So it was all, it was all real crispy. The end. Do 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 do. <laughs> Might be going to the. What do you have here? Oh, it just does it. I can't tell if you think this flies or not, so I'm gonna block. Maybe you think it has flying. I can't tell what you're doing. Okay, you just threw that guy away. That feels good. Yeah, I think you thought. It had I'm flying. pretty sure because look, it's friggin' flying in the picture, so I have to assume you just thought it had float. Yep, that's a pretty bad mistake, but what are you going to do? Hey, look, there's an image. There's an image? Mm -hmm. Okay, I'll click it. Oh, God, bacon. Oh, God, what is this? Nope, nope. Why does it got to have bacon? Why does it have to have anything in it? Why does it have to exist? When we're blocked, defending player discards a card. What is it? Slate Street Ruffian. And a Moomy. That's my Moomy. What you know about my Moomy? Not much. Okay, well, that's unfortunate. When it becomes blocked? Yeah, I'm just getting in there. Oh, and then Does they prevent one. Does she make one. a mean tuna casserole? Pizza Pop says a Hawaiian pizza pop. Black Cross, no. Why? Cool. I literally hate this interface. Why would you not assign it three? It used to assign it enough to kill the thing, even... Oh! Oh, my God. Why didn't that work? Because it prevented the damage, and then it only assigned two damage instead of three damage. Why would that ever... Why would you ever want to do that? I don't know. Oh, my God. That makes such a big difference, too. It makes a really big difference. I wasted a removal spell. I wasted a pump when I could have killed a guy to deal... Oh, my God. And it's like it only dealt one extra point of damage. It's not like it have dealt a ton of damage more. Oh, the old post combat black cat. That's what was that last time? Did we see? 
I mean, we probably knew from the... We could have known what it was, but I don't think we paid attention. Oh, I can just scroll back up. Good luck. Faced Avon Liberator. I don't even know what that is. Nobody does. I had a burger in Philly with chocolate covered bacon and a donut bun. Wow. I think America has a weird fixation with bacon. It's it's almost like it's pretty perverse. Oh, you're not gonna you're not gonna attack with your kitsune, huh? Your kitsune. I can't believe that stupid friggin' prevent the damage. Oh, again, the random one takes the literal best card in my hand. Fantastic. Still random. Six patty burger at five guys is pretty disgusting. That's almost like... Oh, God. How do you even consume that without breaking the, the burger up into multiple parts? You break your face up into multiple parts. Well, all right. Guess we're dead here. Take eight, I guess. Go to 11. Or seven, I guess. Go to 12. Turkish against control. <laughs> Fantastic. Yeah, I'm just done here. All right, cool. All right, thank you guys so much for watching. Really appreciate it. Sorry about the, uh, the 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 results of these matches. They were not ideal, but either way, hopefully you had a good time. I'll see you guys next time. Be sure to slam those like and subscribe buttons. Check me out on Twitch or Patreon. Links are in the description below, and I'll see you later. Have a good night.